First remove the packaging from the M tripod. Inside the packaging you'll have the tripod itself and all of its accessories. Remove the outer bubble wrapping. The red tape uh, helps you to remove the covers. Remove the outer cover. Unbolt the M tripod from its pallet. Prepare your foundation plates for the fixings. There is a foundation template that is provided for the M tripod and there is also fixing kits which are provided in order to assist in the fixings. Alternatively, you can use your own fixings as desired. Once your fixings are in place, pull your cables through the conduit uh, hole at the bottom of the M tripod. And locate into place. In this scenario, we use additional fixings for the front of the M tripod. Securely tighten everything into place. Remove the top section as shown here. Unclip the outer magnetic section. Over here you can see where the terminal inputs are. The switching pair should be wired into its appropriate input and we will be switching a 24 volt feed. So in this one we're going to go into input 3. And we're also connecting it to the 24 volts. Prefix the top bracket. Once the wiring is complete, you can mount the front cover back on. Remember to start at the bottom and push it into place and work your way around the cover, tapping into place. The very top is secured with screws. To mount the arms, these ones have been supplied with a quick uh, drop. So four of the instructions provided, ensuring you put the spacer and the spring into place and then bolt it into location. first power on from the isolator switch, the unit will automatically run through a check speed cycle to find out its final positions. Re 
fit the cover. This unit is being configured for a free exit, but for access control inputs. Please note, this video was taken before the unit on the right hand side was relocated closer to the tripod.